The zoo sheep live on the Indiana family farm, where there's an important task at hand. Today we're going to be shearing our two sheep, Roxy and Jerry. Uh, Roxy is eight years old and Jerry is seven years old. It's a mother and son and we shear them twice a year and just cools them off a little bit as the weather's getting hotter. Take a look at them and those thick coats of wool. Soon they'll look much more slim and trim. Don't worry though, the shearing won't hurt. It's like getting a haircut. Afterwards they lose about 10 pounds. So they feel a lot better. Now, some sheep like the shearing process more than others. All sheep are different, um, and some sheep really like to be sheared or at least tolerate it, and other sheep tend to run from you. Getting sheared is important to a sheep's health. Sheep have to be sheared because their wool will continue to grow if you don't shear it. And so it would get very matted um, and it would get very hard for the sheep to move and it can actually harbor a lot of bacteria on the skin if they would get wet. And so they actually have to be sheared. Some people would like you just to let them be, but that would actually be bad for them. The shearing can also identify hidden health problems. Say they have a tumor and maybe it's covered by hair or if they have some sort of skin lesion. Um, luckily our sheep do not, but in the case that a sheep would, once you can shear it, you would be able to see the skin because when they have that thick coat on, you can't see their skin at all. Zookeeper Sarah will use clippers that look like a barber's, but are bigger, heavier, and more powerful. Now it's time for the sheep shearing process to begin. Roxy, are you ready for the big moment? Let's go. Sarah estimates it takes her around 20 minutes per sheep, but says there are super shearers out there who are so skilled, they can do it in two minutes. Here's how she describes her strategy. I start at the top, at the neck. Um, I like to get all the back done and then go down both sides and then work underneath the stomach. Sarah has to be careful though. The biggest worry to me are the clippers. Um, you don't want to clip the sheep, and so that's actually my biggest worry, is I just have those clippers smooth, and, and they're just able to clip the wool and not the sheep, because unlike human clippers, they can clip skin. She'd like to take all the wool off in one big chunk, but that can be challenging. Roxy's was a lot easier because her wool seems to be a lot lighter um, and the shears clip through it really easily and it comes off in one piece where Jerry's is a lot more curly and rough and that tends to come off in clumps. Remember, this is how Jerry and Roxy looked before. Now, look at the smiles after. Eat your heart out, Miguel Sassoon. For News Channel 15's Wild on Wayne, I'm Nicholas Ferreri.